That line's moving straight out. Oh, oh, here we go. Yes, sir. Woo, I don't know what I got here. Oh, oh. Holy cow, you gotta be kidding me. Hey, what's going on, guys? Just getting off work here this afternoon. Decided to run out to the ranch. I got the poles in the back of the truck. We're gonna try to do a little catfishing this afternoon from the bank, y'all. Hadn't caught no catfish in a while, been wanting some. Caught some a little while back from the wooden bridge. Y'all seen that video? Have not caught any since. Oh, that's about to change this afternoon. I got some chicken liver, got some cut bait. Hey, we about to get in the water. We about to get to it. Let's yeah, see if we can't pitch it in right over there. That's usually a pretty good spot if they there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what you got? That might be a catfish or a big mudfish. I hope not a Oh yeah. Good fight there. I'll be dang that is a catfish. That's a nice one too. Ooh, look at that. Mmm. Old butter cat. Old butter cat. That's a good catch there, but that's exactly what I was after too, boy. There you go. <laughs> Yeah. Make a mess. Appreciate the help. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Look at that, baby. That's a nice yellow bullhead right there. Upper management caught that one. He just happened to show up. I'm down here fishing. By the time he walked up, the rod went off. I said, get that fish. Yeah. All right, come on. Go with it. I'm going to let you run with it this time. He's running with it too again. Uh oh, here we go. Oh yes, that is another cat. Woo baby. Was that a little blue cat? That's what it looks like. Woo, yes sir baby, got that little blue cat right there. That little joker right there fries up good. I don't mind catching them at all y'all. So between that yellow bull, uh, bull head that uh, Butch caught and that one, Shoot, I got dinner already, y'all. Woo, baby, let's go. Yes, sir. Woo, I think we got a bite going on. It looks like something's swimming straight out with that line. It is. That line's moving straight out, guys. That line's moving straight out. Oh, oh, here we go. Yes, sir. Woo, I don't know what I got here. Oh, oh. Holy cow, you got to be kidding me. I got a catfish on here. And this gar, oh, that's a brim. I got a big brim on here, and this gar just came up and eat the freaking brim. Holy cow. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> I had that bluegill on there, and I'm like, holy cow, what I got? Next thing you know, that joker comes up to the top of the water, and that bill gar had that rascal right there in his mouth. Holy smoke. That's a first for me, y'all. Dad, gum. But that's a nice bluegill right there. Woo! Now let's try that again. Man. Now that was crazy. Oh, this pole's getting nailed already, y'all. This pole just got smoked. Well, I thought it was getting bit. I seen it go. Uh-oh, this pole's gone. Oh, 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 let's pull over here, it's gone. Holy cow. I got two. Here we go. Woo, baby, here we go. Holy smokes. I think we got another catfish, guys. I think we got another catfish. I gotta keep in mind my other line. I got the other pole, the other pole's gone too. Holy smokes. Woo, look at that, what a catfish. It was getting a bite. I don't know if he's still on it. Oh yeah, there you go. There he goes. Oh, here we go. Oh, he's got me hung. I felt him on there, but he's got me hung. Oh, no. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, there he comes. There he comes. There he comes. Woo, baby. Woo, son. Another catfish. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Easy, baby. Easy, easy. Oh, look at that one. Another catfish. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Woo, baby, look at that. Got two of them back to back. <laughs> oh, my God. Are you kidding me? 
Man, that was crazy. That's two nice catfish right there, y'all. Daggone, this turned into complete chaos. Got one pole rebated. Let's see if we can't get something to nibble on it. Looks like this pole right here is getting a little nibble. Yep, 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 yep. He's getting bit. He's getting bit. He's getting bit. Come on. He was sure running off with it until I picked it up. I might be hung up. Yep. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Either I got a piece of wood coming up or I got a fish on there. No, it's a fish. I got a fish on here. No, I don't. I got a... Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I do. Yeah, I do got a fish. <laughs> I got a catfish and a stick, y'all. <laughs> hey, that's a two for one special right here, baby. Woo. <laughs> I'm like, what in the world is going on out here this afternoon, man? This is chaos. I'm telling you, complete chaos. Holy cow. Finally home from work, guys. About to clean up this catfish here. I ended up giving all the other catfish, that big bluegill brim I caught, ended up giving all that away to somebody else that needed some fresh fish. Wanted some, ain't been fixed in a while. I just like to take my knife and just score. You just want to pierce the skin just below the head right here. Then you just take your regular old pliers and just grab the skin. If I can get a hold of that, we'll once you get it started, it usually goes pretty good. Just that easy. Then you just grab your old fillet knife. I happen to have my Wallace handmade fillet knife. And we're just gonna knock the fillets off each side. Boy, that thing's sharp too. Just like that, nice, beautiful catfish fillet. So I got the fillets. I just got me some regular old Cajun spice seasoning. You can use blackening season, whatever season you may prefer. I'm just gonna go on and hit them with that. This is one of my favorite ways to cook catfish, especially out in the woods. Y'all know I like to cook out in the woods on the tailgate when I'm fishing. But out there, this is one of my favorite ways to cook. Quick, simple, easy for lunch out there. It's great. I'm about to have it for dinner. A little olive oil, not a whole lot. We get that pan hot, we're just gonna drop them fillets in. That thing gonna take, but a few minutes on each side at the most. Mm, boy, that just smells good. One side, there's the other side. And as y'all can see, I got a fan club going on down here. They just waiting for me to drop something. I like to just take some regular old tartar sauce. If you want to use mayo or whatever, that's fine, but... I like the tartar sauce. Come in here with that beautiful filet. Woo, right there. I like to have a little cheese on mine. Just like that. Come in here and hit it with some lettuce, tomato. I like to throw a few pickles on there as well. Woo, there it is, baby. Blackened catfish filets and Cajun seasoning on it. Some of them old Pringles. I'm telling you, that's a fine sandwich right there. And I am ready to eat. We about to taste it. Oh yeah. I'll tell you what, that Cajun spice season, that's some good stuff. The flavor of the little spicy coming through on that, just flavor wise, not hot wise. That tartar sauce, of course that old toasted bun with the cheese, tomatoes, lettuce. Oh, I can live out the river on that right there, I guarantee it. I think I need to find a napkin. That right there, that's a winner right there. 
Hey, y'all drop me a comment below. Let me know what's your favorite recipe on doing catfish fillets. Might even use it here on this channel one day. I like trying out new recipes all the time. That's one of my favorites to do out at the river for lunchtime, whatever, tailgate, paper plates. Hey, this is just simple living right here, y'all. I'm telling you right now. So that's all I got for you today, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you for tuning in. Watching me catch some catfish out there yesterday. Had an awesome time. That was a lot of fun. Butch showed up, caught the one. The one big one, that was a nice one he caught. So that was a great, great time. Be sure to hit that like button down there for me, guys. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like this to come. But for now, y'all take care and we'll see you on the next one.